Byron Kerr, MassiveSports.com. Kyle, can you go through that uh, levitating when you have to intentionally walk Freddie Freeman and the bases are loaded, what you're trying to do to get a couple outs there? Yeah, I mean, it's kind of a refreshing mindset in that point, honestly, because it's, you know, don't, don't let them score. Do whatever you can to keep, keep the guy from touching on plate. And so I'm thinking, I'm thinking ground balls. I'm thinking strikeouts, uh, you know, shallow fly ball, infield fly out. So strike one is huge there. Get them defensive, get them out of their, their plan, and uh, try and be nasty right there. You know James Bork pretty well and, and what he's been through. Can you talk about uh, what he was able to do to get that double play there in the 12th? I mean, that's, that was kind of uh, exemplified that game right there. Uh, you know, runners on base, backs against the wall, and, and one huge pitch right there changes the game for us. And, and we're, we're so happy for Burke getting his, getting his first win. Um, super pumped for that guy. One of my good buddies down there in the pen. Thank you. Jessica Camerato, LV.com. Hey, Kyle, your composure and the way that you stay poised has come up throughout the season. And it's probably easier said than done just to stay focused out there on the mound. So as the situations get bigger and bigger, for example, bases loaded, being an extra innings, things like that, what exactly is the key to staying focused and poised? I think it's trying to just stay simple there. Um, execute one pitch at a time. I'm sure you guys have heard that a million times, but that's, you know, you hear that because it's the truth. Um, you can't, you can't be thinking about everything at once. You gotta, you gotta funnel it down to, to one simple thing and that's execute the next, the next pitch. That's all you, that's all you can control right there. So that's really all I've been thinking about. On a bigger picture scale, how do you think that you've improved the most as a pitcher from the beginning of this season to this point now? Um, I've been really proud of myself lately because, you know, I haven't had the greatest stretch here lately. Um, you know, gotten hit around a little bit in some of my previous outings. And to be able to bounce back and, and put together um, back to back scoreless outings and, and going two tonight to help us get the win. Um, I'm just happy that I've been able to kind of endure the grind of a major league season so far. I'll be it, you know, it's a shortened season, but it's, it's a grind nonetheless. And, and uh, just trying to be able to be a guy that can take the ball every day. Um, that's what I've been working on. Alex Chapel, Mass and TV. Hey, Kyle. Davey Martinez has turned to you in a lot of different situations. What has it been like for you just to earn his trust, trust and just relish those opportunities? It's been amazing. Um, you know, I kind of, my mindset when the game starts is, is be ready to go whenever. So um, I'm, I'm happy that I've, that I've earned those opportunities uh, to pitch, you know, when we're, when we're losing and it's close, when we're, when it's tied, you know, extra innings. Um, I want to be a guy that, that he can turn to and have some confidence. So uh, for that to go that way so far this season has been, I've been very proud of myself for that.